You know, I think one of the great myths of our generation is that young people don't really care about evidence for the faith. They don't really care that Easter is not just bunnies and candy in a, in a basket, but there's something really important historically that took place. And so for my grandchildren, when I talk to them about the truth of the faith, I find that they're curious about how do we know this is true? You know, I can ask them the question, how do you know that I love you as your grandfather? They call me Papa. How do you know that Papa loves you? Oh, well, because you, you help take care of us and you, you give us hugs and you encourage us. I say, that's right. You can see from the evidence that I love you. And uh, you know, the same is true of God. God has left evidence behind of his love for us. And the biggest evidence of God's love for us is Easter. Jesus died so that we could be set free from our sins. His body there would not remain. He rose from the dead so that we could spend eternity with him. Our God has robbed the grave. That's one of the great joys of life, to be able to tell someone there is hope there is redemption, there is eternal life. This is not a fairy tale, a make-believe or wishful thinking. You can know it's true. You can meet Jesus personally, and he can open the doors of heaven. Never.